Hey guys, Okana here, and I'm going to talk about the trend signal tool, which is what you're seeing here. We just got a signal, a blue dot. Uh, we got, you see, there's a panel here. So uh, we're going to take this trade. Uh, let me put an arrow here so you can see. So we got this blue dot now, just now and uh, we're in this trade so uh, what is this indicator ultimate trend signals is what it's called uh, if you look at uh, the chart here you see uh, we it gives us some alerts you see here buy it says buy um, your usd so barely one minute ago 15 minute time frame see buy signal okay and the alerts are on so let's see if this one becomes a winner or not so i recently wrote an article about this uh, you should read that how to use this uh, the best possible way i'm not a big fan of um, arrows and indicators as you may have seen if you have watched my price action playlist but uh, if you use this together with price action if you're a beginner uh, it's a good helpful tool to get you started uh, to do some trading while you're also learning. So your focus as always should be to learn how to actually read the charts without all these junk on it. No indicators, no um, no arrows, no stuff like that. Uh, so anyway, how do we use this the best possible way? How do you, you use ultimate trend signals? So the first thing you see is the panel here. You see here, uh, it starts with the one minute chart, it says up, strong, bullish, right? See the difference here? Here it says uh, bearish, right? But here we have convergence, okay? It means convergence uh, because there is, uh, most of them are green. You see most are green, so one minute, five minute, uh, 15, all the way it's green. But uh, the higher time frames are strongly bullish, which means uh, today's um, market is bullish if you look at the higher time frame you see that yeah it's correct it is extremely bullish we have a hourly candle going up so that's a good indication uh, and uh, so that's good it gives us a signal but also what you should also consider is that price is above the pivot what is a pivot it's the average price so if you look at it on a uh, higher time frame you see so it's calculating the average uh, price where price has bounced many times so it's an uh, uh, like a support resistance line okay uh, and then you have the daily open so when prices are above these uh, two lines that's uh, much better for bullish signals if they're not then uh, you should look for put options so for example I would not do uh, put options when prices are bullish um, so keep that in mind you want to go with the trend so going back to this 15 minute time frame what about expiries how do you choose expiries so there are two ways uh, as i've described in the article you should definitely read that before you use this indicator because uh, if you look this indicator up on google some will tell you to just if you're using 15 minute then you should go with a 15 minute call i don't think that's a good approach I think you should use price action like I have explained in the other videos when it comes to expiries and such you should always use your own brain so here we see price is trending up so that's a good sign that's the first good sign so don't just look at the dots and say oh there is a blue or, or red I should go for a put option don't do that you can do that if you want to lose most of the trades so use your own mind okay price is above the pivot that's good uh, we saw on the higher time frame price is moving up that's looking good and then we move down to the desired i'm using 15 minute in this example you could use the five minute um, time frame if you wish uh, it gives you signal on various uh, time frames you see 30 minute hourly and four hour but not above daily i think yeah see there's nothing uh, on the weekly so uh, again so use your own mind use your own brain we got price trending up that's a good indication that we should be looking for call options and it's above the pivot that's a, also a good indication that we should be looking for calls the panel says 
strong bullish signal pretty much all time frames are green that's very good uh, convergence so it's not a mix uh, so that's also good and uh, we got a signal we got the alert a um, few minutes ago so now let's just wait and see what happens with this signal okay guys just want to show you uh, when exactly we got the signal if you look back we got the signal on 1501 which is my uh, uh, time in my current location not the metatrader time but my own time on my computer so 1501 and 30 seconds which is pretty much uh, somewhere on this candle okay so this is where we got uh, so pretty much after this candle closed uh, or in the middle of it somewhere so right now we are uh, pretty much out of the money because price retraced down so we're gonna see what happens we got about 20 minutes left because uh, why 20 minutes because if you look back we see the price moving up for a good uh, 30 minutes before uh, retracing back this one is very large so I'm counting this as two candles I mean you can see how it engulfs everything else here you see all these candles you got four five 15 minute candles are not as big as this one so I'm counting this as two and then we got two 15 minute candles here before so I'm thinking another two which is for 1530 so we got the signal on again 1501 so that's about give us about 29 minutes expiry uh, on this uh, which uh, currently already eight minutes have passed so 20 minutes 21 minutes left uh, on my clock so we're gonna see if the next one closes bullish this is gonna be a winner um, so let's wait and see what happens <laughs> guys looking good so far we got a few more minutes to go we'll be looking back on this soon to see if uh, it was in the money or not okay guys about to expire now just a few seconds left and it's over it expired on this candle here which it gives us about five six pips or so if you look at it on the other time frame this is the one minute time frame by the way so we got our entry somewhere in the middle of this candle i mean i happen to open my chart at that moment i'm not sure if it would have given us a uh, sooner entry uh, or not um, it's possible because on the one minute it gave us this entry so if you look at the uh, uh, 15 minute time frame so we got our entry somewhere here uh, I'm not sure why the dot the blue dot is on the candle before maybe because there was an earlier signal uh, but regardless you see it doesn't repaint uh, it doesn't jump around so it was a good signal price still moving up a good um, strong upgoing 
signal and we used a good expiry thanks to looking at previous history instead of just taking a random expiry which would have probably made us lose or become a tie see here it got back down before it moved up so uh, why did we win this because we used common sense we didn't just jump in on every dot that we got we used a trend line we saw strong bulls here we saw we are above the pivot above the daily open we, we had good convergence you see the, the signal at the time was uh, uh, bullish on multi multiple time frames was green all the way so that was a very good uh, confirmation and um, knowing price action obviously helped me in this case because I could see immediately why we got this signal I don't know if you noticed we got the, the signal on the breakout here you see price here broke out on this candle so we could have again we could have had better entries using price action instead of just following the ultimate trend signals uh, regardless um, you can get winning trades with this but use your mind use your brain watch my price action playlist if you're a beginner learn the basic techniques before you jump into this uh, or you will just be randomly taking uh, calls and puts on the dots and that's not going to work out well in the long run you need to go with the trend okay guys thanks for watching read the article in detail because it explains exactly what to do and how to get this indicator so please read the description so read the article and uh, you will know how to find and download and install the indicator thanks for watching don't forget to like and subscribe See you next time.